Let me ask you about C.J. Stroud and, you know, the kind of the pre-draft information, smear campaigns that happened. Because I remember when C.J. Stroud was coming out and the knock was, could he process the information at the line of scrimmage? And I think there was something, a cognitive test, and he didn't do well, and that got leaked here. How much of that is happens even now that a team may want C.J. Stroud, but then they have to pollute the waters to make sure you don't take C.J. Stroud? A team may do it. Uh, an agent may do it. I think the agents are a lot more in that process, too, of leaking out information like that than, than even the teams in that case. So everyone's trying to throw out smoke screens and posture. I mean, that was the thing that never really made sense about that. And I've never taken that cognitive test. I'm, I'm not sure how effective it is. I know there's a lot of people who really believe in it or portions of it. But when you watch the tape, you never saw that. And that, that was one where, you know, maybe if you get a test like that, you go back and watch it and it either confirms it or it doesn't. But I've always been a big advocate of saying, like, what does the tape tell you? And the things about C.J. Stroud's game, which made him the number two overall pick and made him potentially looking back on it where we should have looked at it and said he should have been the number one overall pick is his accuracy and playing from the pocket. Like he was so accurate and lethal downfield throwing the football. And that that's what wins. Like as much as we get enamored with players who can extend plays and create off you know script plays, because those are the splash wild plays, that's still not always what win Super Bowls. I mean, Tom Brady is the best case of that. Obviously the greatest of all time, in my opinion. And, and he played from the pocket and won from the pocket. Now, Mahomes has the ability to create, and he's obviously trying to chase down Tom Brady now. So we'll we'll see where that goes. But that was one of those things that when you looked at CJ Stroud's game, you could have made the case he was the most NFL prepared from that perspective of any of the quarterbacks who were up in last year's draft. You just, you really didn't have any concerns outside of like some of the smoke screens and stuff that people would throw out there. Yeah, I just watched the Georgia game, and I go, he can play. I mean, he's great, and and he's showing that. 